Hey, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, and today I am showing you this extremely good looking 2020 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara with the Altitude Edition on it. This one has a 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor, and it also has the eight speed automatic transmission. It's gonna get you 22 miles per gallon on the highway, 19 city for an average of 20. Um, as you can see, the altitude package on this one looks really good. Gives you the color match hard top, the color match fenders, uh, the black rims. Really good looking um, look on this vehicle. It's a really good package. And uh, we're gonna go over all of it. If you have HD capabilities, we shoot everything in 1080p, 60 frames per second. So turn those on if you got them on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device. Cause it's definitely your best way to check out the looks and styling of the Wrangler before seeing it in person. And if you want to check out all the photos on this Jeep in our upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website, check that out there. Comes with the 18 inch gloss black painted alloy rims. And it's gonna come with Bridgestone Dueler HT 25570 R18 tires. They're kind of a highway tread pattern on them. You get the gloss black fenders, the blacked out Jeep and Wrangler Unlimited sticker there. Also the blacked out trail rated badge. All the hardware on this vehicle is black. You get the gloss black headlight bezels, grill inserts, as well as the fog light bezels are also gloss black. This one has the LED lighting group, which gives you the LED running lights and the fenders, the LED headlamps and the LED running lights, halo lamps there, as well as the LED fog lamps. Got the black tow hooks, the plastic bumper, Really, really good looking. It's like black on black. This one also has the optional Mopar step bars, which look really good on this Altitude Edition. We're gonna check out the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this at any second. I'm not gonna go through everything, but just to show you that, yes, it is a Sahara first and foremost. Um, black is the exterior and interior color. You got the three six and the eight speed automatic. But on the top of the sticker, it does show Altitude Edition. And um, here are all your, your um, standard equipment, I guess you could say, and then your exterior features are standard right there as well. So like all the optional equipment, which is the Altitude package, which is a 25L package, is $3,295. You get the 18 inch rims, the leather trim bucket seats, wrapped park brake and shift knob, the Freedom Panel storage bag, the rear window defroster, color matching three-piece hard top, rear window wiper washer, hard top headliner by Mopar. Um, this one does not come with a soft top. Comes with the wizard black instrument panel bezels, which I'm gonna show you in just a little, back, little bit here. It's uh, on the dash. It's like a metallic black, looks really good. Mold in color bumper with gloss black, body color grill with gloss black, and black interior accents. This one also has a cold weather group, which is $9.95, gives you the heated seats, heated steering wheel, and remote start. The LED lighting group, which we already went over, is $11.95. And then the 8-speed and V6 give you um, $32.50 for a total to get those two together. You also have those $4.95 black step bars. And then uh, $49.370 is the MSRP. If you want to get your summit price in the upper right-hand part of your screen, is a link to our website where you can check out all the rebates and incentives on this Jeep if it's still available. 22 highway, 19 city for an average of 20. And then it's rated for front and rollover crash test ratings, nothing else. Anyways, the, the wizard black that I'm talking about is this. It's like a metallic black, looks really good. Um, we'll check that out a little bit more in a second here. You get the T50, which lets you know which Torx wrench to use on the doors there to get those off. The color match hard top, everything is gloss black on the back piece and the front pieces. Gives you the LED tail lamps as well, matching spare tire and rim. Get the little gray Wrangler logo there. LED license plate lights, you get the rear tow hook. Back storage area, a lot of space back here. That's your saw or your hard top bag for the uh, front hard top pieces. Notice these bars back here are all 
painted black as well. You get that insulated hard top, which is this black stuff here. It's kind of like a foam covered in carpet, which uh, helps with noise. It also helps with uh, heat in the winter. Got storage underneath there, door hinge bolts, roof bolts, and windshield bolt holders. And then underneath there are your jack tools. You get the JL badge right there, which gives you wheelbase overall length for the two door, four door. Also gives you water fording, overall width, and then tire um, width, I'd say. They made these back gates a lot lighter, so they close a lot easier now. Otherwise, the uh, hard top works pretty much the same as they did in the JK. You can see how nice and smooth that rear gate closes now. Get the blacked out fuel door, and that's metal. Get a good look at those step bars there. And it does come with heated power mirrors. Inside you get the, the altitude package, gives you the black leather seats. The cold weather group gives you the heated seats. You do get the driver's side height adjuster. You also have the lumbar on there. And then they do come with side airbags. blacked out floor mats as well. Notice it's all black around the Jeep there. Auto headlamps, you get the tilt and telescopic steering wheel. You do have audio controls on the back of that steering wheel as well. Power mirrors, power locks. And as we hop inside here, you can see that this one has the seven inch LCD display, digital speedometer, outside temp and compass display as well. You get the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and then those audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. This one comes with the seven inch Uconnect 4C radio, so you get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. This is also where your backup camera shows up, and that's my favorite part about the new radios is just the high definition on them. They are crystal clear. You get the dynamic grid lines, meaning that they're gonna turn as you turn that steering wheel. And uh, just really nice and clear. Get that center line that lines right up with the middle of the vehicle so if you're going to put a hitch on here you line up to the hitch every time you do have your climate controls on here as well including your dual climate controls you have your heated seats and heated steering wheel buttons you can do all your apps here as well you can um, actually connect your phone through android auto or apple carplay to project to the screen so if you have a navigation system on your cell phone, such as Waze or Google Maps. You can project it to the screen and then you can use it through the screen there. And it's um, actually really nice and it's like you have nav right on the screen. And um, yeah, we actually did a demo of it if you wanna check it out in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to that video where we did a demo of Android Auto. So a lot of cool stuff you can do with this radio. And then there's just a couple more settings you can do and then a couple more apps on this side. Anyways, if you wanna do more climate controls with the tactile buttons, don't worry, you got your buttons and knobs down here, including a volume and tune control for the radio. You got your start stop capabilities, you can turn those off and on. Stability control, downhill assist control, and you can turn the screen off as well. Down here, you got a media center with an AUGS USB and USB-C jack, four by four shifter on the floor, eight speed automatic transmission, you do get the little Jeep logo on there. You also have the heavy duty key fob. It's kind of a switchblade type key fob where the key snaps out like so. It's really a heavy key fob, heavy duty. You're always gonna know which key you have in your pocket and it does have that remote start, which is a really nice feature. Just taking a look at that wizard black dash trim. It goes all the way across and you can actually see the metal flake in the sunlight there, which is really cool. Now the front hard top pieces are insulated as well. They come off just like the old JKs. A couple of quick disconnects there. Two lockers that disconnect there and then a couple more quick disconnects there. You do get home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems up there as well. And we'll take a quick look at the back seats and then do one more final walk around on the Jeep here. Back seats, you get a lot more room back here than the old JKs. I really like um, the room that you do get. I like how easy the seats go down as well. Other nice thing is these headrests. 
they fold down. If you just want the headrest down, they go down like so, so you can see out the back better. But if you want the whole seat down, the whole seat comes down nice and easy. It's a nice flat surface and um, you don't have the problems that you had before with it catching on the seat up here. So that's really nice as well. You do get a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in back here. And then you also get two USBs and two more USB-Cs. Factory floor mats. You do get the child safety locks on the back doors. And that's about it. I still think it's one of the best looking Jeeps we've ever had on our lot. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you will have saw, thought the same thing and checked out the Jeep with me, learned a little bit about the altitude package as well as the LED lighting group and the seven inch radio. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it, go to our website, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left, a link to more Wrangler videos like this one on your right. If you have not been to our website, on the bottom link to this vehicle on our website, click those, check us out, and we really look forward to helping you with this brand new 2020 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara Altitude Edition in black clear coat. Thanks again.